Can creamy white discharge be a sign of pregnancy or infection during your period? Hello there. Today we're going to talk about a topic that many women have questions about, but often feel shy discussing, vaginal discharge. In particular, we're focusing on creamy white discharge and what it might mean. Can it be a sign of pregnancy? Could it indicate an infection? Or is it just a part of your regular menstrual cycle? Let's break it down. What is normal vaginal discharge? Vaginal discharge is a regular and natural part of the menstrual cycle. It's your body's way of keeping the vagina clean and healthy. Normal discharge is typically clear or milky and may have a slight odor. Its texture and volume can change throughout your menstrual cycle. Creamy white discharge can be completely normal, especially during ovulation and just before your period starts. Can creamy white discharge be a sign of pregnancy? Yes, creamy white discharge can be a sign of early pregnancy for some women. This type of discharge, known as leucorrhea, might increase in volume due to elevated levels of estrogen and increased blood flow to the vaginal area during pregnancy. However, it's not a definitive sign of pregnancy. Many other factors, such as hormonal changes throughout the menstrual cycle, can cause a similar type of discharge. Can creamy white discharge indicate an infection? It's also possible that creamy white discharge could indicate an infection. For example, yeast infections can cause a white, thick, and often clumpy discharge that looks like cottage cheese. Other symptoms of a yeast infection include itching, burning, or redness around the vagina and vulva. However, it's important to note that not all white or creamy discharge is cause for concern. If the discharge is accompanied by other symptoms, like a foul odor, itching, burning, or unusual discomfort, you should consult a healthcare provider. So, can creamy white discharge be a sign of pregnancy or infection? The answer is, it might be. But it could also just be a normal part of your menstrual cycle. Remember, every woman's body is different and what's normal for you might not be normal for someone else. The key is to know your own body and to seek medical advice if you notice any changes that concern you. We hope this video has shed some light on the topic and made it a bit less confusing. Stay healthy, and until next time!